Hey guys, good morning. Welcome to Vlogmas Day 14. It is a nasty rainy day outside if we're being honest. And we have to deal with something outside. Jason's tire got a nail in it or something. So it is now flat. So we're gonna try to do the fix a flat thing, take it to the store, but we realized it's Sunday. So discount tires is it open. So we're gonna have to do that tomorrow, but at least it's not just like continually getting that flat. So we're about to do that. I'm looking for my other croc. I literally cannot find it. And I wanna wear them since it's raining, but. Oh, there it is. You found it. It was under the bed. Thank you, baby. Well, thank you. Are you okay? <laughs> but I loved yesterday's vlog, so be sure to check that out because we got a table and it was just a fun one. But let's go out there. You all want to see what it looks like? Pretty ugly. Let's fix this tire. <laughs> It's like a straight up nail right there. Yeah. Holy crap. That's insane. Uh, 13, 14, 16. 16. <laughs> I messed you up. Wait, this is cool. I've never used this before. Whoa. Oh my gosh, it's working. See it going up? Yeah. Whoa. That's okay. Okay, cool. So look, it aired it up a little bit more and now we're just gonna drive it around a little bit. What is driving around do? Well, we just can't drive around. We just can't drive around, then we're gonna go to Whitford. And then we're gonna put some air on it. I have no clue what we're doing, I'm scared. Also, welcome to Jason's car. I don't think I've ever filmed inside of it. Maybe I have. But it's just a cute little doable Honda. Is it a Accord or Acura? Uh -huh. I mean, Accord. Honda Accord. But it, it does great, gets the job done. All you need, it's got a sunroof. My car don't get a sunroof. Okay, drove around some. Now we're at Quick Trip, getting that free air, and hopefully that works. So I'm gonna come out in a second and see what it looks like once he puts the air in. Sorry, you girl ain't getting out right now. You, I need to stop doing this. What is this? I keep doing this in my vlogs. Ooh, yeah. It's like really getting air. Good job, baby. All right, let's go. It's aired up. This is going to have to do for now. You don't want to try all your other tires? No, we do. We like The nail. Man, I can't believe this. Like, it's really pumped up now. That's why. Hi, everybody. Okay, we're about to do something fun. My head's probably going to be cut off this entire clip, but that's okay. But we're about to open up some pomegranates. So I just got some when we were at Walmart. And now I want to open them. And I just watched a few videos over how to do it. And the one that I liked was where they open it up actually in some water. So I got this napkin here, towel, because I'm a freaking mess. And if you've ever dealt with pomegranates, they are super messy. So I'm going to tuck this in like this. Okay, here we go. So it said to cut it along the top. So there's like grooves right here where... That's how the pomegranate is sectioned. So let's work it. Let's try to do this. Ah. Okay, so I'm cutting it around the top. Ooh, and the pomegranate. Okay, so I opened up this much of it. And now it says to cut down the sides. It said to score it. So there's one. Oh, well, this is good because now that I cut the top off, I can see where each section is. Why is my hand hurting? I just started. <laughs> Ooh, it's working. I'm making a mess. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to open it section by section like this and dump it into the water. That's going to clean the pomegranate, which I don't know is necessary. And then also will separate it from like this pulp that's probably going to come out with it too so here we go oh my god okay so there is the first section and the pomegranates you can see just kind of fall to the bottom so i'm going to repeat this step with all of these and i will let you know how i liked it how it worked because i also have one more to open so let me go ahead and get 
all of this first one open, okay? Holy crap, there is so much pomegranate that comes out of one pomegranate. So this is how much just came out of the one. I don't think the water actually has any purpose besides maybe just kind of cleaning the seeds and separating the pulp from it. It's not like I'm like dumping it in there, but that's the remainder and I got all of it out. So that looks really good. I'm gonna keep doing it. I got one more. I did not know how much comes out of one. So now I'll know for next time, but I just want to go ahead and still peel the second one so I'll have all this available to eat and snack on because I do really like pomegranate. It's been a long time though. So again, what I did was I just cut around this top and pulled that off and then I was able to see the inside of the pomegranate and followed it down the lines, pulled off one piece at a time and just got it all out. So we will repeat that process one more time for this one. This is like a relaxing little Sunday activity. I got some pomegranate on the table runner is what it looks like. I'm never getting two pomegranates again. All you need is one. Okay, y'all, now we're talking. Oh gosh, it really got on my face. Now all of the pomegranate is done and in this bowl. So look at it all there. So what I'm gonna do is strain it all out and just show y'all how much I got. And here we have it. That is so much fresh pomegranate. So we have drained out the pomegranate and it is all in this tub now. So now you can literally just get a spoon and eat it and have it as a little snack. So that worked out well, I would say the water was good just because I feel like these are really clean. It did kind of separate the pulp. There's still a few in there, obviously. But cutting it in those sections and then breaking it apart, definitely a must. So try that if you're getting pomegranate. I just wanted to bring y'all along for the experience and opening them. And look, they look great. Wow, that's a lot of pomegranate. I love it. I can't wait to eat some. Okay, so I know that pomegranates are super healthy and such like that, so I wanna look them up, what it is. So they're high in antioxidants, they're good for your heart, and they help joint pain, and they're good for useful in battles against breast and prostate cancer. That's kinda cool. So yeah, they're high in antioxidants, I think that's the biggest thing, and just with the sicknesses going around, and well, we're over it now, but that's pretty cool. I'm thinking of making like pomegranate water just because I really do have a lot of pomegranate. So um, I might look that up and see how to do it. Also, I put this up yesterday, the jewelry holder, and still have yet to put my jewelry up. So actually, let's do that right now to just get it done. Well, this is funny. I literally cannot find a place to put the camera so you can see me putting it besides on the actual jewelry holder. So that's no help. I can't believe I've had all this jewelry in here. Let's see, so we got married on the 7th. I've probably had all this jewelry in here for about a month and a half. So that's pretty crazy because I haven't worn any of it. But let's go ahead and just put it onto this organizer and maybe I'll just flip y'all around here. It'll just be like a low angle. Nice! So that worked out. I just flipped over a container and put a shoe box on top of it. And um, now you can see me put my jewelry up. I hope it's not all tangled.
turn the camera off just for a second but this is what it looks like with all my jewelry on it some of it is just gonna stay on the bottom so like these are some hair clippy pieces and just hoops at and studs that don't really have like a place that they can fit so these are hoops earrings and bracelets that are all on this wire right here and just more jewelry earrings that can hook onto that little mesh and then it goes down into my necklaces so this is kind of what it looks like i just think it's a fun little accent right there also kind of used as decor in the room i really what i would like to do is go through i feel like i now just like more dainty pieces of jewelry so more things like this piece here even like this little star so i kind of want to go through and see like the things i don't really wear also if you remember from my very first vlogmas day one we went through and we talked about like what our weird gift was this is the necklace that i talked about that was from my aunt yoli i still love it it's such a fun necklace it's really cool won't be giving that away but yeah so here is my new jewelry set thank y'all for watching with me and setting it up <laughs> hey guys ah! <laughs> that hurt hey so it's later i curled my hair for funsies i also painted my nails just was like let's just do some small stuff and jason just literally lint rolled my hair and it pulled it but we're gonna go to his parents house for a little bit they just moved into a new place we're gonna go check out the new place and also use their washer and dryer since we don't have one but thank you thank you to them for letting us do that i'll update y'all when we get over there goodbye we made it over here to the nuggets, other know. parental controls. I didn't get okra. <laughs> yeah, he I went, was... he goes, I got corn nuggets. <laughs> but we got Chicken Express and that's gonna be dinner tonight. Easy money. Yeah. Ooh, those fries are so good. All right, so that was super fun, guys. We are leaving now. Actually, QT, but also Jason's parents' house. Um, when we were there, we just caught up, talked, chit chat, ate some food, did our laundry, and now we came to QT and got hot chocolate. I've been wanting hot chocolate for a few days now. So, do you got it? So I'm so happy, but we're driving home now. That's about it for today. It is late, it's like 10.30, late. But thanks for watching, you guys. We'll see y'all in tomorrow's video for the next Vlogmas. I can remember the vlogs until I say bye. Like, is this Vlogmas 14? So, holy crap. This is Vlogmas Day 14, so I will see. I guess that is hard, because I'm not even thinking about the day tomorrow. Thinking about the next day. Vlogmas 15 tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Like this video. Bye. Mwah.